Hey, hi, welcome to Dee and Dory. Welcome. We're so glad you joined us this week and hopefully you've had a wonderful week of thrifting and sewing or thinking about it even. That works too. Right, yeah. <laughs> so what have you been up to? Me? Mm -hmm. uh, you, you want to talk about what we're going to do today or what have I been up to? I don't know. I've been up to taking a lot of naps lately. <laughs> That's what I've been up to. At least you, I like to take naps. At least you haven't been up to no good. Remember that was the saying? Are you up to no good? That's true. That was a saying a long time ago. I don't, you don't hear that kind of saying anymore, do you? No. And in fact, on one of the, the TV shows this morning, mm -hmm. they were talking about some of the sayings that people say today. And I have I have no young people around. So there Except are... For I, me. Uh, you don't count as young anymore. Sorry. <laughs> I'm younger than you. Hate to surprise you, but you know. I got my young earrings on. Looking yes, you funky. do. You, yeah, that's all right. <laughs> you look great. Yeah. Yeah, you're not nearly as extreme as, uh, I shouldn't say extreme, but out there, you know, some, some, some of us, as we get older and older, we just do the fashion thing like to the umph degree, which is fun. It's a fun thing to do to see people with all of these. The fun fashion yeah. things. I love watching them and seeing some of them. We on, some on social media. On and some, uh, uh, you flowers. have bobbles and flowers. Bobbles and flowers and multiple rings. Oh, just a few. <laughs> you don't have like on every single finger. No, I don't. Which That's is a fun true. thing for some people. I have um, six rings on. Three, four, five. Six rings. Six rings. And I have two. My uh, my I are three. three. Oh, three, excuse me. I can't count. Well, this, she, this she lost her counting. This <laughs> doesn't come off. I can't get this off. But anymore. it's still a ring. It's still a ring that I just kind of discounted it. But I have my mother's, I inherited my mother's arthritis in her hands. And so my knuckles are getting larger. And so my rings, I can't, none of them that I have really. This should be. You're not be taking calcium, ring. are you? No. Oh. No. So once I was told they calcium can't. does that. I used to wear a scant five. I can't even, I can't get anything near that anymore but anyway well this week we did thrifting <laughs> so there you go and i do want to say we got nate's in the room with us he's kind of chilling and taking a nap in his chair so if you hear him he's that's him okay just to warn you okay so what did yeah. you say this week we have what we're, we're thrifting oh we're thrifting yeah see we i don't even listen sorry <laughs> okay go ahead it's okay um we have <laughs> we're going to start with the same from our inspirational saying yes, this positivity is from may jemison may jemison was born in 1956 she um is an american engineer physician and former nasa astronaut she also wrote several books for children and she was the first real life astronaut to appear in star trek really yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, they had called her and said, because she loved Star Trek, and mm -hmm. she became an astronaut. Yeah. I mean, it was kind of cool, because in Wikipedia, they had a picture of her in her astronaut outfit. Yeah, very you know? cool. So they called her and asked if she would like to be in um, one of their shows, and she said, yeah. Of course. Yeah. Yeah, she'd love that. So here's what she said. She said, it's your place in the world. It's your life. Go on and do all you can with it. And make it the life you want to live. I like that. Yeah, that's very positive. You know, yeah, and sometimes sometimes some people will say something to you and it will make you think, Oh, you know, I shouldn't I shouldn't do that or whatever. Mm -hmm. You know, and it's not anything that's gonna hurt anybody, so why not do it? You know, it's your life. You live it the way you want to live. Yeah, I, I I can, yeah, I'm not going to say too much about that. Yeah, you do want to live your life the way you would want to live okay. it. But there are times that circumstances do prevent you from that. Right, circumstances do. But what, what, what I'm talking about is, like, for instance, um, we're going to show some fabrics that we got at thrift stores. And I know when we've done this in the past, people have said, don't you have enough fabrics? Yes, we do. <laughs> yeah, but, but it's our life and we want to live it this way. <laughs> That's not hurting anybody. <laughs> and, and I've also seen, yeah, that's cute. I did see some cute things about, you know, sewing is one thing. <laughs> fabric is another. Buying fabric is another thing. I, they, the two do not, it's, they're two separate hobbies. <laughs> yes, yes. So anyway, this is going to be about things that we have found in thrift shops. Now, we were not able to go together. So usually we try to, mm -hmm. but we, we were not able to. So 
Some of my stuff is from, I took a small little trip to um, Chicago. So I got some things in Chicago. Mm -hmm. And then on the way back home, I stopped at a place in Michigan and found some, some more. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then what I show you, we did go together because I was over to her place. Yes, but, but I, I did not buy have... one thing because I let you buy it. That's true. Usually, yeah. I would, usually well, we're like, ah, eh, no, I found it first. <laughs> Well, not really, but... No, but usually you're, you're like, yeah, this is really pretty, I want... And I'm like, wait a minute, I don't get out that much. So but I didn't right. even... I was like... Yeah, she was good. Yes. It was the lady who came in behind us that bought everything oh else. She bought an entire car. It's a good thing we got there when we oh, did. Oh, yeah, there wouldn't have been. Because... Really, the the next person in the checkout line behind us had every bit of fabric that we did not, that she did not yeah, buy. Yeah, that I did not buy. Yeah, it was, wow. <laughs> but that's all right. That's, yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah, So, Okay, what are you going to start first? Um, I'm going to show my fabric first, I'm thinking, and then you can show your fabric, and then mm -hmm. I'll sh finish with the patterns I got. Okay. How does that sound? Good. A little bit of mixture in there. So I'm going to start with my two pieces I got in Chicago. So um, I've already washed all these fabrics and folded them uh, and measured them. So this is three yards of orange and white. It costs a total of $2. And it's polka dots. Pokey pokey dots. Pokey dots. I just can see something from the 50s made out of this. And it's a very light. No. Yeah. It's not too yeah, bad. It's not too awfully. Yeah. It's not like a voile, but it's not heavy either. So it's a nice top weight. Yeah. And I like the colors. Mm -hmm. Of course. Yeah. Of course. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. So I got this and then this here, this is hilarious. This is where my eyes were not working right. I thought it said it was 50 cents for this piece. <laughs> She's always hopeful for so a good deal. Thinking, oh, that's great. 50 cents. I'll, I'll make something out of it. I thought I'd even, like I'm going to make another purse, but just in case. <laughs> It would be a good craft item thing. And there is one and three eighths yard of it. But what I thought said 50 cents, it said 250. So I got this one yard and three eighths for 250. It's still good. But it's still something. I'll make something out of and it. And that's nice and heavy. That is. It's, I think it's probably upholstery fabric. Yeah, yeah. That's what sort. it feels like. It. But. Yeah. So then after Chicago, um, the patterns I'll show you later are from Chicago, but these are um, now back in a thrift store in Michigan. This is... This is from a community thrift show yes, store. Yes, yeah. So I like this thrift store a lot. Yeah. I always find fabric there, and it benefits the hospital. Mm -hmm. So I think that's great. Yeah. Great cause. So this is five and a half yards of beautiful teal, and this is almost like a, a light denim. Really light denim type. Yeah. What does that look for? I, I, I don't know. It's a different type of fabric. I could see yeah. a suit out of it. It, like could, a it would make a beautiful like suit. Like a suiting. Yeah. And there's five and a half yards. Yeah. So that's quite a bit. It's 56 inches Or a wide. nice, you know, dress with a lot of detail to it. Oh, and then not a flowy dress, but something that's more uh, tailored. This Because it's just this plain fabric, you could embroidery something on it. It'd be really cool. You could. <laughs> With my embroidery machine. You could. Okay. So, um, oh, I do like the color. It's beautiful. Yes. And in that, I did pick this up in, at the thrift store, too. So they were having a special on anything that way. It was blue tagged. And so this is just some netting. But you know what I want to make? I want to make an old-fashioned hat. And I want to have some netting on it. Oh, okay. And so this was 70 cents. I, didn't, I haven't taken it out to measure it, but. It's plenty, I know, for a hat. So that's my idea with that. And this next piece, I did pay full price. This was not on sale, but I lost the tag, so I don't know how much I paid for it. But it's two and a half yards. Um, and I liked it because it's a... Oh, it's a nice silky net. Yeah, and I need to open this up because I need to show you the pattern because you can't tell just with it all folded like this um, what it looks like. I can refold it later. But then you can see, see the pattern in it? So Ooh, you want to nice. see that? Yeah. yeah. Isn't that nice? Ooh, look at that. What yeah. do you think you're going to do with that? Quite the design in it. Yeah. I'm yes. not sure. I, I was thinking it would make a very nice dress. Mm-hmm. 
No, because it would lay nice. Oh yeah, it would. Whatever you make out of this, is, it'll lay nice. Yeah, very pretty. It's very, very pretty. And it's unusual. It's brown and black and gray. Yeah, and I think, is that a little green or not? So uh, it's tan I, or it, green? To me, it looks like it's uh, tan. But does I, it look like to you guys? No, sure. I think it does look more tan. Anyway, yeah, so just have to fold that How up. many yards was this? Um, there's two and a half yards. Wow, quite a bit there. Yeah, so, um, and then there was um, these two pieces I thought looked really good together. Because this is a navy, and then this is a plaid with navy in it. Um, this is... The navy is two and seven eighths yards. I paid five dollars for, and this is two yards. I paid four dollars for. Nice. So, yeah. yeah. And I thought you could actually use them together somehow. Yeah. Very nice. So that was another one. This one, um, there's not enough to make a dress, but boy, would it make a pretty dress. There's only um, one and a half yards, but it is sixty-two inches. Can you do a tunic? A tunic top out of it? Sorry, I was paying attention tonight. <laughs> a tunic top out of it? Yes. That would make a nice Isn't winter tunic pretty? top. I don't know if you can, can you or some sort of, it's beautiful, the design. The design and the, the fabric. It's textured, the textured yeah. design. Yeah, it would make a really nice tunic. Or even if you wanted to make a cardigan. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It would make a pretty cardigan. Mm -hmm. It would. Yeah. Yeah. So there's that one. Oh, I was thinking it'd go with this, but it doesn't. Colors are just off. Just a hair off. Yeah. Then I found this one. Um, this one is um, 58 inches and two and a half yards, and I paid $5 for it. It's a stripe. It's a stripe. Green stripe. It is green? Yeah. Definitely okay. green. Is it? Okay. Yes. My eyes have been cleaned, and now they're, and now they're <laughs> no, green. Yeah. <laughs> yes. It's green. But anyhow, this would make this would make either a cute shirt dress or even pants because it's got that stripe in it. Mm -hmm. You know? Oh yeah, it'd be cool cool slacks. Yeah, cool slacks. And make a nice shirt dress too. Yeah. It would work great. And I love this fabric. This is three yards. Well, two and seven Oh, I can see a blouse out of that. Yeah. And I did pay seven dollars for it. But it's Two and How seven eighths yards. Oh, two and seven eighths. Yeah. Almost three yards. Almost three yards. But it's kind of a, like a little bit silky, but not too. Oh, it's really light. Yeah. It's and it's light. not a heavy, it's not a heavy cotton at no, all. No, but it would make a pretty shirt. Pretty blouse, yeah. Yeah, it has With a nice poofy, you can do, you know, they're doing those really poofy sleeves yeah. now. Detailed what sleeves. what are they calling those sleeves? Um, I don't know what they're calling them. But they were all over TV this morning on the morning show. <laughs> Uh, do you can you there is a specific name that they're using yeah it remind me of the victorian area oh, the I can't the name name of it. and the last piece that i got there was um it's it reminds me chico's has this travel knit travel knit mm -hmm. and this is 52 inches by one and three quarters and it was four dollars and it does remind me of the travel knit it's very stretchy yeah it's it will not looks wrinkle. The same. Yeah, you cannot even wrinkle it if you wanted to. Yeah, it's very yeah. nice. So, now, what color is, are you seeing that? I see this as a green for sure, an olive. Yeah, and it, has a dark little, olive. it has a little bit of um, brown on your tone. See it? No. There's a little bit of shading to it. Oh, sheen to it. Looks yeah, like see? to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, well, you can't see it, but take our word for it. <laughs> anyway, so that's that's the fabric that I got during my thrift haul. Very, very nice. Um, I have one more piece of fabric that I didn't get in my thrift haul, but my dear sweet aunt gave me. And there's a lot of it here. I haven't measured it. Oh, look but at that. I am in love with this. Oh, it's a toil. Yeah. Oh, toil, not toil. toil. Isn't that? And it's a farm scene. Like there's I like a farmer this very and uh, a dog and birds and. I'm in love with this Yeah, this fabric. is gorgeous. And I know somebody would probably use it. I mean, it would be pretty to have pillows made out of it. Curtains know? out of it. But it's not the color scheme of my house. No. No, it's but not. But you know what I want to make out of it. Yeah, bibs. Absolutely. I How knew. fun would it be to have bibs with a cow on it? Or a horse and some ducks and a farm scene. Oh, it would be 
absolutely had people. Yeah. Is it, they got a pig sitting up there on top of that. I think that's a cat. It's like a pig. <laughs> you me. ever seen a pig on a roof? No, but I just thought, <laughs> you know, hey. I think it's a cat. Yeah. It's an awful big. Chickens. It's an awful big cat. Well, yeah, cats can be big. It's a farm cat. <laughs> Eating lots of mice. Ah, okay, yeah. you poor mice. But I love this fabric. Thank you, Aunt Pat. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Yeah. Beautiful. Yes. She also gave uh, a bunch of the curtains, and I shared them with my yes, sister. Yes, wonderful. So Thank you. Um, I was thinking some of them I might cut up, but some of them I'm going to use as curtains. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So we well, appreciate I'm definitely that. going to use them as curtains. Yeah. The ones I received. So. so out. Here, here's your fabric back. It's got pins in them. Watch. Well, it. yes, I have them all folded. You have them all folded. Well, mine are still in the bag that I purchased them out of. <laughs> but the first one, and I don't know how much. It's a fleece. Wow. And it is gorgeous. Look at that. It's it like is. a camping. You know. Oh yeah. Uh, I like it. it's got the moose Ooh. and the canoe and the lantern. I did make something for you or for Nate. Uh, probably I'll make a, a shirt out of it. Or um, a night shirt for Nate out of it. Yeah. Or it's going to become something nice. But there is, for me, it's got, I think we both could get something out of here. Because I think there is. Oh, my goodness. There's a lot of there's yardage here. There's a lot here. of yardage here. This is so double. So this is probably four, four, two, one, two. Yeah, there's probably four, four yards, yards. Four yards here. And it's. And it's wide. Yeah, it's wide. So this How will cute. need to be laundered. And it's really, really nice. Now the tag on this said I paid. Uh, four ninety nine yeah. for it. So that's not bad. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't think it says. I love the colors. Where? Yeah, the colors. You know, are gorgeous. The fall in our challenge box. We haven't picked it yet, but there is a challenge in there to make something for Nate. I know there is. Just, yeah. Just so I need you might to. Wanna... Yeah. Keep so that in mind. So this was really cool. I really like this. <laughs> it was a nice, nice fabric. <laughs> so now the next one is definitely a Nate. And this is a flannel. Oh. And this I paid $3.99 for. It's fire trucks. Fire trucks. Fire trucks and fire hats. He likes fire trucks and the ambulances and all of that. So this is at least three yards, three and a half. Yeah, at least. At least. Because she's double with it. Yeah. yeah. So. Um, fire yeah. trucks. So. Okay. Well, they're a definite pattern. They're is definite. There? Mm hmm. Yeah, I always try to cut everything See, out according yeah, to the map. Yeah, all going this, you know. That way. Yeah. That direction. Yeah. So I need to be careful that way. Yeah, just remember that. But I do, do think it's kind of interesting. I intended for use as children's sleepwear. But, I mean, what else are you going to do the flannel? Why do they make it flannel? So I hope it's a good flannel. It feels nice, and I hope it wanders up right. Oh, you laugh, and Nathan likes that. But I thought, this is so cute. I could make something cute for mm -hmm. him out of that. Yeah. Nice. Actually, this would be a nice sleep shirt for him. Yeah. So. Anyway. And then uh, here comes another one <laughs> that could be used for Nathan. And Looks like it's a good Nathan haul. That was a good Nathan haul. So somebody got rid of their fabric for um, oh, boys. It's another fireman. And this is another $4 one. You can see there's all kinds of, it says firemen, firemen, fire trucks, and there are fire hats, heroes. Yeah. Yeah. But now this, I didn't, I did not take this one apart to see. Whoa, there's a lot. Here. There is a lot here. So I don't know if somebody was going to make a quilt or what. That's oh, yeah, what look at this. Maybe. Oh, I might have to make a pair of pajamas out of this for me. Or that actually a shirt. I can make a shirt for myself, too, or something. So, like, there's one. I think two. they were going to use this for the backing. Three, oh, of a yeah. quilt. Mm -hmm. Four. Yeah, five yards. Did I say four, five? Six. Yeah, yeah at least six, six yards. So, David Textiles Incorporated do not use for children's sleepwear. So, but adult sleepwear would be fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wondering why that would be fine for adults. But I'm wondering, you know, it seems if like you I use can... it on the back of the quilt, is it considered sleepwear? No. So the the um I wonder what as an adult you could use this for. I could make out of it. Well, 
if your husband was a fireman, you can make a dress out of it. So I'm, I'm representing my husband. <laughs> but he's but, not. <laughs> yeah, and this would make a cute shirt for Nathan. I could make a cute yeah. shirt out of this. Now that, and that would look good on him because he looks good in his blues. Yeah, or a light jacket and line it. Oh, you got all kinds of ideas now. For him, yeah. So anyway, so all of this needs to be laundered. No. So that was the super buy. That I've got good buys. Yeah. Now this also goes to that collection because it's a bunch of ladders, fire ladders. <laughs> you can see them. Wow. But, but you know what? This. It doesn't look. No, this. I was thinking of making a dress out yeah, of this. this you could definitely. Because I like. And she paid three ninety nine for this one. Yeah. And this one, there's a lot of this too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of this too. So at this is double. Yards. So there's, you know, yeah, there's at least four, probably five yards here. Mm -hmm. So I've got yeah. more than enough. And this again says do not use for sleepwear. Which you weren't going to wear it to bed anyway. No, but I seen that and I thought, or you could make a beautiful blouse out of this. See how pretty that is. A dress, a dress, yeah. you know, and there's just, it can be used. Yeah. Yeah. This, I don't think it would be. Yeah, it, this it, doesn't look like a kid's. <laughs> I mean, you could use it with the other and make it look like, you know, like if you were doing I a quilt. Could make some I can see somebody was going to make a quilt. Yeah, somebody was going to make a quilt and then for some reason didn't get to it. They decided not to because they had a whole bunch of other fleeces. They had some girl stuff there, um, but that didn't appeal to me, the girly stuff they had for some reason. Because um, you were thinking of Nader. I was thinking of Nate. Yeah, I'm making stuff for Nate. So this would mm. make a nice man shirt too. Mm -hmm. If my hubby would wear it, I could make my, him one. My husband won't. Yeah, John won't. My hubby won't either. Yeah, he won't wear it either. But it would make a nice one. <laughs> That's why I can say it would make a nice top for me, too. Mm -hmm. You know, I could dress it up or just mm -hmm. make it a nice casual one. Mm -hmm. So that was it. That's mine. One, two, three. Is that what I got? Three or four? No, four. Four? Yeah. Oh, yeah. The, the light flannel one. As we both both are heading down. And Sorry. <laughs> now we shall return. So that was my fabric haul. So, so I'm going to show you my pattern haul. And then I also got just um, for 70 cents some seam binding. There's one, two, three, four, six seam bindings, different colors in here. It's interesting because the one on top yeah. shows it was three yards for 13 cents. At pennies. At pennies. All the stores years and years ago, as most of you remember, almost everybody had fabrics and they had, you know, you could go buy fabrics almost anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. So these I got in Chicago and the thrift store had them for 50 cents a piece. Oh, nice. So this is, I, I've never sewed with Berta yet, but it's so easy on it. Yeah. That's one thing we have not done. Oh, Berta easy. Let me, let me take a look at that one here. Yeah, and you show them the back of it because I think it shows the, the detail of it. Oh, it's the same as on the front, though. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, but it has a little more. It says the different fabrics. A, crepe satin, B, Georgette, and those are different languages. So. Yeah. And then the, the So this button. is from Germany, it says. Yeah, this is, is that what, yeah, imported for, for Can Canada. Let's see down here, it says it's made in Germany. Yeah, and this is all taped. Yeah. So I can't get into it. Yeah, they, they were taped. Well, not all of them. That one was. <laughs> seams and hems are included. So it says seams and hems are included. <laughs> well, good. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. You'll find out. <laughs> so then I've got a Simplicity 2418. Cute. Yeah, that's cute. I like that. Very cute summer summer top oh mrs top and excuse me with I'm neckline so variations and a tie so belt. sorry it's not she's not boring it's just i'm tired <laughs> very nice yeah two links on it not a whole lot of um variations with it but it's cute what well, is different variations of the neckline you got yeah there's of, two there's a scoop or there's a little little decent. not enough for you for 50 cents <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. And this is a two-hour dress by Simplicity. Oh, they nine, used to have those one, two-hour patterns. Yeah. Is that a shift dress? Yes, it is. See, and it flares. It's not straight up and down. Oh. 
Well, okay. She's talking about one of our challenges. Yeah. Things. Let me see. What class we could do that? Mrs. Dross. Yeah. Yep, that's it. Go so ahead. Just looking at it. Then I got a Vogue 9899. I think I like the long, what do they call those? Dusters. Oh, the dusters. Yeah, yeah. and it says overlies, oversized, <laughs> oversized, <laughs> oversized online A line duster. Is uh, with the duster, but it also comes with the shirt and the pants. So nine eight nine nine. Very nine nice. Eight. Very very nice. I got a sewing with Nancy nine two three eight. That's by McCall's, and it's just the shirt, but it has it with long sleeves or with a uh, shorter sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> and then another McCall's nine zero two nine. Oh, this has the nerve room neck. What? The nerve room neck. The neckline. That's what they called it. I, I, I knew what that was because I liked that style way back when. This is mandolin collar. Well, mandolin collar. Mandolin collar and nerve room neck. All right. And this is 9029, which is a macaws. Um, and it is an online jacket, a top, a full on pants, and skirt, and two leaves. There's no back drawings. There isn't. Not a back drawing back nope. there to be seen. Just nope. lots of little numbers. <laughs> and then here's some McCall's 5754. Cute. And I then, like that. Uh, this kind of neckline uh, looks good on, on me. I've made several things that has that. It seems to not make you look so busty. Not make me look so busty. <laughs> I don't know about you, but... Anyway, that's a cute one. And it good, it's good to cover up your tummy, too. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Plus. <laughs> this is a cute summer top, 6976. Yeah. And Nate's over there waving at y'all. <laughs> Hi, Nate. 6976. Oh, how cute. That's got lots of different things in it. Six. Top six options and one. Yeah, that is cute and cute. And then here's another new look with six options. This one also says six options. It does. This six, nine, four, five. Six option tops. Yeah. Ooh. Must have been a thing. What, does it say what year these are? But oh. they're six, year, six years. Uh, well, I know. Waste all your time looking for that. She can look while I talk about the next one is Vogue. <laughs> yeah, like I usually find Vogue, Vogue 7053. This is a tunic and pants, very loose fitting. A-line tunic above knee link or lower calf. They are printed in the USA. <laughs> yes, we got it. that, we had that part done. Yeah. So um, I don't think here's the line drawings for this um, Vogue 7053. And while she's still looking at one more. <laughs> I'm not going to find it. This is by Indigo Junction. Oh. So this is, yeah. And it was, it was this one was a dollar. Oh. Instead of 50 cents. It's cute. It's really cute. It has some cute. I like I like that. There's one that has a little, oh, I don't know if you can see the little design on it. A, yeah. I like the one that they show on the front and plaid. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that it's a five-way wrap, it says. Yeah, and it doesn't seem, for large, it takes one and five-eighths yards of 45-inch. What? <clears throat> one and five-eighths yards of 45-inch fabric. Huh. Or if you're going to use a 60-inch, no matter what size, you need one and three-eighths yards. So, it's so like a one-sizer. Yeah, yeah. But the original price, it says $12 on it, so... Fifty. Oh uh, no, a dollar. I paid a dollar for this one. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, flower pin included. Instructions for the flower pin. What flower so, pin? On the back. Show me. Oh, oh, it's hard to see. It is. I don't know. We can get a good shot of it uh, because it's in this plastic, shiny stuff. But there's a little flower pin that's included in it. Very nice. I like that. I do like that. I really do. I like it also. Yeah, have to make it sometime. Oh, very nice. You can make it out of one of your flannels, which I do have. <laughs> yeah. So that's it for our thrift haul. 
Yes. We hope you enjoyed the thrift farm. Ha, thrift farm, ha. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. <laughs> yeah, well, you can tell. It's, we're tired. I'm tired. <laughs> She's catching it for me, I guess. Yes, yeah. It's like, oh, yeah, I can take a nap. Don't forget that it's your place in the world. It's your life. Go on and do all you can with it um, and make it the life you want to live. So says Mae Jemison, who was the astronaut, the lady astronaut. Yeah. And it does require some motivation and stick to goodness. You are responsible for a good share of your life, no matter your circumstances. You, know, you can right? make it positive or negative. I can. And I mean, one. we can. You can. We can. Yeah, but sometimes the circumstances are way beyond your control. True. But you, you can still work with it yes. to a certain degree. So there we go. Wow, she's full of energy today. You can tell. That's <laughs> well, thank you for watching. Please hit subscribe, like, send us a comment, forward. Um, oh, what, there's a, send us send us your makes sense to and ISO ISO two at mei net. I can't even say it. ISO two at mei dot net. Yes, and don't forget the thumbs up game for That's right. You guys have a great week. And what? We'll be more energetic next time. Oh, I even tried to do this caffeine before the time today. So it's to work. <laughs> okay, more energy coming your way. See you next time. Okay, bye. Bye.